Oh my God, imagine the gym. Imagine the gym. Imagine the basketball, the, the indoor basketball court. Imagine the pool. Imagine the, the, the just like in the house having like the center's gonna be the kitchen, all just like glass looking out to the infinity pool. Then you have like the, uh, the, 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 the outhouse, who's like, we have this room here. All right, so everyone like, wants to know what happened to Christian Guzman, mainly due to his recent upload where he went over his goals, his ambitions, but he seemed out of character. And of course it garnered a lot of comments down below the video of people worrying about his mental health, his physical health, thinking that he's doing this, this and that. And I kind of want to give some closure of what I think it personally is. Now this video is gonna be quick and short. For those of you that know Christian, you probably clicked onto this video, you know how hard he works. You know he has Alpha Elite, he has all of his other stuff he's doing. He's maintaining his social media platforms. He's doing everything on a day-to-day -day basis far more than majority of people are doing. So we already know he's gonna be sleep deprived on top of everything that is boiling up internally within his head. Maybe he's dabbling in some Adderall, you know, the good old Addy from time to time. Those of you that know and watch my channel know I have dabbled in just about every single thing that is imaginable on the planet and I can kind of spot it when I see it. So my hunch or my guess is it's a combination of a lack of sleep and then either the good old snow Adderall, um, you know, there's a couple other things that could be on the list. But my guess is probably just the lack of sleep with either Adderall or blow or maybe a combination of both, to be honest. Now, why did he make this video? Um, I mainly believe he made this video not because he truly felt pressured to make it. I think he is just so excited. And once again, I give a round of applause for Christian and everything he does on a day-to-day -day basis, being an entrepreneur, going as far as he has after just starting, you know, essentially on a YouTube channel and creating everything he has to the point now where it's at. Uh, it, it deserves a round of applause. And I think just where he's at, he's excited about his new projects and everything that's coming out. And he wanted to really lay that to his fans and yeah he's probably going off of a lack of sleep just because of everything new that is going on and that's already on his plate and then had you know some things to help assist in making him be more productive but unfortunately some of the drawbacks is when you accompany not only the lack of sleep with some compounds did you get a little uh, crackhead type vibes right and that's essentially why he was so jittery you know talking so fast a lot of it was incoherent didn't really make sense because in his head you know due to the lack of sleep and Essentially what I'm guessing would be Adderall or Blow as you guys can hear Barry down here emphasizing as well you, you have something to say, but I see a lot of people thinking that Christian is you know dabbling in some hardcore stuff that that's all he's doing He's not working um, You know, this is the downward spiral of Christian Guzman This is the end of him and I don't think that's the case at all um, And you know, I could definitely be wrong Maybe it is, I don't wanna think that, I don't believe that, just because I, you know, I've seen his content progress. I've been watching him since the very beginning of YouTube, back when Chris Jones and Pump Chasers was making content, when the Hodge twins were making their fitness content. He's a true OG of the fitness industry, and to see him come as far as he has is just really a mind-blowing thing on its own. Can you stop? You know, I'm trying to film video real fast. But uh, <laughs> back to the video is, I think he's gonna be fine. It's just a bad day. He rushed a video. You know, I think a lot of the people that watch his channel, if you were doing what he is doing on a day to day on a day to day basis, sorry, majority of you probably wouldn't even be able to do that anyway. And then accompanying that with the amount of workload he's taking onto his plate and not sleeping because of it, because he wants to continue to provide the quality and continue to build brands and everything there, is he has to then supplement other things in in order to take on that workload. Not that he has to, but of course it is gonna help uh, for those of you that have dabbled and have tried some things, you know how tremendous and how much it helps. So I don't blame him for doing it. I have done it many, many times. I still do it to this day. Yeah, I don't think this is the end of Christian Guzman. I think he's his brands are gonna continue to succeed and push further and further and further. Who knows if he gets his pro card with everything he's doing and all the brands. I, the one thing I do, or the one criticism I do wanna offer to Christian is do not wear yourself too thin. He seems to be the guy where it's just never enough. You know, he's gonna set a new goal. He's gonna reach some crazy new height and it's still not gonna be enough to satisfy him where he's still gonna want more and more and more. And eventually you just have to come to the realization that you have to be happy and content with where you're at and be able to be content with that. You know, actually realize the accomplishments you've made and how far you have come. Because of course everyone wants more, 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 more but eventually it gets to a point where it actually does take an effect on not only your mental health, but your physical health as well. You know, along with your relationships, those start to dwindle because then you start to prioritize work and everything there and you're too run down to want to do anything fun and actually enjoy the things in life. 
So that is the one criticism I would offer. But once again, he continues to kill it. Um, I just want to give you guys an update because I have dabbled in many things. And I feel like uh, it's not as big of a deal as a lot of people are making out to be. I think he was just excited about the projects and everything he has coming up. It was on a bad day, a little bit of a rush video. And I hope nothing but the best. But uh, yeah, just make sure to be careful.